crazy terrible <laughs> because I was just crying. Um, they were happy tears. It was a good thing. Um, I really hope that I can re-listen to the voicemail that I just left my friend Alice because I'm just so completely overtaken with joy and here it is still coming out. I've never gone into a race just knowing that it was going to be amazing, like, not having the stress of, like, oh, I got to perform, but, like, just knowing in my heart and knowing in my spirit, knowing in my brain, my soul, that it's just going to be awesome, it's going to be an awesome experience, and whatever it is, it's going to bring glory to God, and I'm just so excited about it. And I'm so thankful for it, because I can look at it, and it's like, yes, I did run all those miles. You know, I've put, I don't know, we'll say roughly a thousand miles on this training um, season. You know, yes, I've ran through rain and, you know, I still remember one of my first long 16 milers. It was terribly chilly and rainy and crappy and I was running through puddles and it was two loops of eight miles and I was just like, ugh. But from that hardship to every other hardship, mentally, physically, um, emotionally, mentally, like everything I said mentally, didn't I? <laughs> to see God bring me through that, that's what I have to give credit to, period. Like, yes, I did the work, but James, it's James chapter 2, verse 8 or eight, one of the two, but it says, you know, you say, it's basically he's saying, okay, you have deeds, and you say, you know, show me your faith, but I'll show you my faith by my deeds, and the funny thing about that is that it, I think it takes longer to see for something to 